unlocked Ozar Mox as a character now. Okay, stage 5, Neo Tokyo 2019. Hey, it's the current year. Sadako's hacker gang have stolen a prototype cyber rig from the government research labs. Rumor is that the rig incorporates some kind of alien biomatter and is powered by crystal Latisse energy. Faked computer records, which the hackers planted at the labs, have framed Ghost for the break-in, and now police are crawling over the tech quarter looking for him. The only way for Ghost to clear his name is to tail one of the hackers to their secret research area and gather evidence of their activities. So this is going to be a stealth mission at the start. This is cool. of a chance. Sorry, that was bad. Very Blade Runner-ish, though, this stage, which is pretty cool. Okay, so just a little bit of background on this stage. You can't be seen by the hacker that we're following, which is the lady right in front of us. I'm pretty sure it's the splitter lady. Um, you can't be seen by security cameras, and because Ghost is wanted by the cops, the, you can't be seen by the cop cars patrolling the areas either. We're gonna need to use our... This is the only stage where really the temporal uplink comes into play. It allows us to see with the, where the cameras and stuff are. So we'll need to use that to avoid... to dodge the cameras and to try and follow the hacker to her hideout. So yeah, we need to follow the hacker to the research area, gather evidence of time to research, upload the evidence to the local police server, and retrieve the time crystal. And again, we need to minimize civilian casualties as a secondary objective. not quick there, then a cop car does patrol him. If it sees you, then it's mission over. Break open this glass to get some weapons. Now we'll hang back a little bit. I found that it's easier to go down that staircase there and wait for her to go by, rather than just following her. Because that gets you some weapons also.
Don't get too close there because sometimes she sees you in her peripheral vision. This is how we get her code. Alright, and that's pretty much it for the stealth portion of this stage. Cameras are off, so we don't have to worry about being seen now at least. For the record, this code changes all the time, so the only way to get it is to view her with the camera. Let's blow up this gun right here. Way they don't come into play at all when in a little bit. Right, so let's take a picture of this splitter research. We also need to take pictures of the plans. Now we'll upload them here to this computer. Let's do this quick. Shut off the power to the splitter machine. Let me just restart from the checkpoint. Can't shoot through that. Okay. 
little bit left now. Yeah? Pretty much right after we take uh, upload the pictures, then those gun turrets will become active. So it's better to just take them out while they're inactive. Quick. I guess we're just sticking to the machine gun. Cops are using sci-fi handguns. Now we need to find that splitter woman. And there... Oh, nope, that wasn't her. Barely pulled it through, but we made it. Yay, 